Hello everyone, it's Lisa. Welcome to Heal Talk with Lisa. I found a place that I am connected and I am connected with you all. So, hello to the world. One of the messages I got today after being dropped so many times was, would you talk to me about hypnosis and what is hypnosis? What is hypnosis? Let me, before I even talk about hypnosis, I need to explain to you how the mind works. Our mind is in two parts. One is the conscious part, and the other one is our subconscious part. Consciously, we look, listen, and learn. Subconsciously, our subconscious mind captures everything that we looked and listened and learned into a place called the storage, the subconscious part, which is that little chip inside our mind that stores all the information that we held on to. Another thing that our subconscious mind does is recalls all the information that you stored in there. So by doing that, it's like when you want to think about something or memorize something, and then it's like, ah, oh, what does that name? And the moment you do this, it's like it re uh, rewinds itself and goes into recalling all that information. Now, the third thing that our subconscious mind does for us is that it regulates our entire bodily function. So what does that mean? That means your heartbeat, your pancreas, uh, every nerve, every muscle, every organ that is working at this very moment. I hope it is healthy and functioning to its fullest. That's what it does. Without you thinking about your heartbeat, without even you thinking about your pulse or any of that, it's working for you. Now, you would think, why can't she find a place that is more quiet? Well, I have this thing about being outdoors, being with nature, being with all that surrounds me. You see, until the time that I didn't say anything, although you hear all the sounds behind me, you're not really paying attention to it because it's all about my voice, isn't it? You are so in tune with my voice with my voice that the rest of the things do not really matter. As a matter of fact, you might even be following every step that I take, wondering where I am. All that is being aware that is your conscious mind at work. What else is happening? In between our conscious and our subconscious mind, there is a critical factor, a fine line, where it analyzes and criticizes, it rejects, and it also does a lot of other things for you. What does it do? It's a filter between your conscious mind and your subconscious mind. So everything that you looked, listened, and learned, just like this video that is capturing my face, everything that I am seeing, every movement, and everything else that is behind me, it's also being captured at this very moment. Sometimes we're not even thinking about what's happening or all the sounds that surround me, the birds, the wind, until we rewind it back and look at it at our own comfort. So everything from the day that you were born until this very moment has been stored. And when you want to think about your childhood or even a toy that you loved, maybe even named a certain car or even a doll, perhaps a pet that you had. You know, just a moment of thinking about it, recalling it, it may even give you a good feeling, a feeling of comfort, a feeling of ah. Uh, you know, every essence of us is capturing everything. So what happens? 
is the scent when you hear, when you smell the cologne it reminds you of someone when you hear something a music that takes you to another world it takes you to another place all that is a reminder a reminder of all the things that it's stored in there emotionally physically mentally so at this very moment realizing that every essence of who you are like a storybook has been written and it's called this is your life every pain every hurt every action every reaction every behavior even the habits that you have held on to and created for you and by you if it's no longer good through hypnosis and hypnotherapy we delve into our conscious mind and through our state of relaxation going deeper into our subconscious mind we open that file and we look through that file and as we look we find that one behavior or habit that we no longer want and then we pick it edit it change it modify only certain parts that it's no longer necessary and then we put it back and you file it with a new name and that new name new behavior new habit of becoming stronger and better healthier whatever it is pain-free that is the file that begins to work in your subconscious mind and everything else gets stored in the archive which is the deepest part of you and your mind which is the unconscious level so with that guess what being hypnosis at this very moment being in hypnosis it's an internal process not an external force I have absolutely no force or no control or no power over you no hypnotherapist does because it is the client it is you that chooses to enter into that state of deep relaxation allowing your mind and allowing your body to relax and once you get to that level of relaxation that's when you tap with them and you say that is the change that I want to make you know we are not born smokers we are not born with pain we are not born with certain ele elements of like eating cheating gambling all the ings that I talk about so every ing that we are ready to modify and become better and healthier and stronger we can do it through our subconscious now why is it that the subconscious mind works much better it's because you delve in and you get to it much faster than just talk therapy or doing it consciously because consciously and talking about affirmations it can only do so much if the grass has some weeds you can't just say no weed no weed no weed no weed and for the weeds to go away hi Lilith hello Grigor hello Lawrence oh my god Lawrence Zarian is on the line and watching me oh and everyone else so today at this very moment I am grateful for having the ability to have learned how to transform certain parts of me I used to be a smoker I am no longer a smoker I've had so many clients of mine that have come and said oh I wonder if you can help me it's not about me it's about do you want the change do you want to make that transformation are you ready to become a non-smoker or drop the weight as I call it drop the weight or change any habit in your life 
pain management is one of the biggest things that we do through hypnosis because we delve straight into our nervous system imagine it and you go in and it's just like a pain block and we block it if I can hypnotize myself and have three root canals if we can do so many surgeries with no anesthetics and I'm not saying this to go against the medical world but it is to show you and let you know that the power of your own mind over your body and having your body work with you is so much greater than you have given yourself permission to do think it and you will to live victoriously is to stand up for yourself to go beyond your own expectations and know that you have the power you have the control and when you are ready you can accomplish anything so today what is hypnosis is an internal process that you allow yourself to enter every day you go in and out of hypnosis which is another form of trance state which is another form of saying I go into that zone most of us are in that zone when we are watching a computer and a game some people are gaming some people go into that zone when they are in a sport playing a sport dancing and some when they are gambling that moment that nothing else matters and you're in that zone that's self-hypnosis so make the changes reaffirm the best qualities of you and go after the things that you do want in your life versus the things that you no longer want with that I bid you goodbye for this very moment and thank you for being a part of me at this moment. Live victoriously because you matter. Bye-bye.